haven't been sick for the last few days with some kind of upper respiratory bleh. I'm gonna make a puzzle. So I'm gonna take my two energy, hope, and I'll be able to finish it quickly and then go right back to bed. <laughs> so let's get puzzling. Let's get crafting. Puzzling. Let's make a puzzle. Okay, got our little work area set up, and here is our high quality artifact puzzle. Wooden artifact. Okay. So, cool box. Let me guess what's inside. What are we making? Well, I've had this for years and it's never been made, so. Let's do it. Ta da! Leo the Lion. This is what we're going to be making, and I hope pieces are here. So let's take a look. I don't know how many pieces are here. Oh, look at that. It's in the shape of animals. Some of them are in the shape of... Oh, well, look at that. That's really cool. Okay, so interesting, interesting. This isn't going to go together how I would normally put together a puzzle. It was a very strict method. I find all my flat edge pieces, I set them to the side, I flip all the pieces up so I can see what they are, and then I make the frame of my puzzle with all the flat edges and corners, and then I start working my way inward. So I have no idea um, how I'm going to do this. So let's just get started. Let's, let's dump them out. Let's just pray to the poos of gods. Nice spots. But uh, we've got everything here. Okay. All right. Oh, check him out. It's cool. Oh, it's stuck together. Uh oh. Okay. Cool. All right. <laughs> it's a battle unicorn. Okay. No silly business. Monkeys. No. All right. Let's get these, I guess, sorted. There's really... Maybe I can define the edges for this like I normally would. I really don't know. So I'm just going to um, put on some classical music and, and get to it. so far is generally just kind of put things with the like patterns and colors um, these intricate ones here I've placed over here and the ones that I'm pretty certain have to do with the face and the ears I've put over here so I think we are ready to really get started here we go
right, so the good thing is this is a beautiful puzzle. The pieces are very nice, but the maddening thing is, is that it will not stay together. I have to keep pushing it and poking it and trying to keep it together. So when I've built puzzles in the past, I glue them. What I'm going to do with this one is I'm going to glue the pieces down to um, some acid-free paper. And if there is a, a point in the future where I want to um, put it together again, which I really doubt, I, I can take it apart very easily. So let's start over. All right, so I have started to glue the pieces down on, except for that piece, onto the paper. And I forgot I was not recording, so I am going to start from here. I'm going to put it boop, and put that in there just like that, and then we will do the rest. Okay. out beautifully I love it I love it I love it I love it definitely I don't have a frame for it I had no idea what size it was going to be there was nothing on or in the box that would indicate the size of it so it I did glue it to some acid-free paper and at first I was using the Elmer's white glue, which was um, not the best idea because it was making the paper wet and wanting to, you know, kind of crumple. So then I switched to the glue stick and then we didn't have any more problems at all. I did have to rearrange a few of the pieces because um, they were a little too tight. But other than that, I just love this. It is just so beautiful. And I honestly can't remember where I got this from, but... If I can find it, I will put a link to it. 
on um, Amazon in case you want to get one of these beautiful puzzles for yourself. I am going to go convalesce a little bit more because I'm still feeling rather puny. So thanks and we are getting so close to 500 subs and that is just so exciting and so awesome and it's just so neat to to know that there's other people that enjoy the kind of things that I like doing. Maybe you're here for the time lapse. Um, maybe you're here just to see the projects or, you know, whatever reason you have. Um, I appreciate it and I hope you enjoy. And yeah, so I'll see you next time.